Yo, 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 what is going on YouTube? It's your boy Molespawn. We make these videos for a reason. The main reason is if anyone's not home, whether you have work or wherever you may be, first off, let's just start off by saying Gang Hey Fat Choi, right? Happy New Year to anybody celebrating, but we got new challenges. They should be they should be here already right so in the lifetime agenda or the new moments of the month we were saying this was one of the coolest things ever and we were hoping they would bring it back and they did so this was the derosing grinds right the derosing it wasn't that hard and this time around it's pretty much the same thing so you need to win one triple threat game whether it's online or offline you get a ruby right i'm gonna tell you guys how to get all the rubies i'll basically go through everything just in case you guys aren't able to get on now you'll know exactly what you need to do we'll talk about if this is going to be worth it and obviously i believe it will be so you need 150 points single player so you could do that in triple threat if you wanted to or something like that you'll also get another ruby like that then you need 10 threes in a single challenge game so you need to play a single challenge game so you might as well go there and that will help into the single player points obviously get a triple double you know what that means do it in the challenge game obviously and then you need to get 42 points in triple threat online so this game should be a triple threat online game right you need to win two games pretty much and you'll be able to finish this and then you get the ruby so what are the rubies you will know right now because there's Onyeke, who you would then need five blocks in order to unlock the Amethyst. So Ruby Onyeke is one of them. I will obviously, I could put the pictures up, whatever. You guys know what they are more for the most part, but we'll talk about them if they're going to be nice. Compazzo, 12 assists multiplayer, right? So you need to get 12 assists in multiplayer for an Emmy, and then you need to get 25 in six with Luke Kennard for an Ami, so that's gonna probably cost you a challenge game or a Dom or something like that. You need six steals with Troy Brown Jr. Troy Brown Jr. to get the Ami, and then you need 21 points with Trey Lyles in Triple Threat Offline for an Ami. So, so far, nothing really too hard. You'll have to do a couple of like challenges here and there, right? Because obviously you need the triple double, you'll need the 10 threes, Luke Kennard's probably gonna need a challenge game, and then you unlock the Amethyst. So Amethyst, you got this man, hey yo, hey yo, who needs 24 and 5, okay? You need 19 rebounds multiplayer with Jared Vanderbilt. I almost called him Van Vliet. I don't I don't even know what I'm reading because there's a Van Vliet in here. <laughs> so Vanderbilt needs 19 rebounds multiplayer. Then you need 35 and 6 with Terrence Davis. So that's going to be one of the more annoying ones. I recommend, highly, highly recommend doing the 60 point challenges, the 60 point weekly challenges, whatever they're called. Um, you, you know what I'm talking about. In the single player, I'll show them off at the end. You need Mo Bamba. You get an Amethyst Mo Bamba who needs 32 points and three blocks. Also recommend the 60 point triple threat game. Those are definitely, definitely the vibe to do these without a doubt in my mind. Now you need eight threes with moments malik monk nice and this has to be multiplayer so thankfully 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 these are all multiple games you don't have to do it in one game because then that would have been annoying so you can just play with him in triple threat online or whatever you're gonna play and he's an amethyst malik he had a good game the other day and then you unlock the diamonds the diamonds the diamonds so diamonds you have evan fournier who you need 41 points in clutch time this is literally exactly like exactly like the DeRozan grinds which wasn't too bad it wasn't too hard nothing like that so you get 41 points with Evan in clutch time and you unlock a pink diamond Trent Jr Gary Trent needs 33 in triple threat online then you got Miles Bridges who needs 38 and 12 so once again the 60 point games are your best friend when it comes to challenges they will help you knock this stuff out you can make Bridges one of your tallest guys he'll be able to rebound a little bit better and you can control him stuff like that Yusuf Nurkic needs 22 rebounds in multiplayer. So Yusuf usually one of the harder players to do challenges with in general. He's not the greatest, but hey, I don't know, man. Some of these cards should be pretty valid, pretty valid. I'm excited to show you guys the pink diamonds. The pink diamonds are actually pretty elite, but like name wise at least. And man, I'm excited. So Karis Levert, another diamond who needs 30 points in clutch time. So I would definitely take the two clutch times in together if I could. So Karis LeVert, one of my favorite players because he used to play for the Nets and he was a beast. And then these are the pink diamonds. You got Chris Middleton, who is a sniper as always, man. A free Chris Middleton pink diamond. You will have to play unlimited with him and get 34 points. So one thing I will say is if you're not the greatest at the game, which a lot of us are, including myself, right? We struggle. You don't actually have to win any of these games pretty much, right? You just have to win like one triple threat in the beginning or something like that. 
So you can go into these games and just drop buckets and lose the game. It doesn't matter. Unfortunately, you won't be able to score the points and then quit because then it wouldn't count. So just something to put out there, like don't rage. If you see someone else doing something, maybe help them out, especially if it's like clutch time points, stuff like that. I, I know the community has been helping each other out for the most part, so I'm just throwing it out there. Feel free to do that. And then Jaron Jackson, a pink diamond needs 12 blocks. That's awesome. You get a free Jaron Jackson Jr. 12 blocks and then you'll get consumable. So I expect the Hall of Fame badge in here the same way they had it last time. Expect the shoe, expect shoe boost and a diamond contract so all that should be here in the consumable option pack i'm gonna try to run through these as fast as i can or as best as i can and i'll see what's up i will have that in the no auction house video we got a fred van vliet the guy that i was confused about a little bit earlier he needs multiplayer games and he needs 121 points i would probably do this in triple threat online i think it makes most sense a little fast a little easy you get about 21 points per game so you can finish this in about six games not bad if you're winning if not You'll play a little bit more, who knows? Now you also have a pink diamond sub bonus who needs triple threat online games, 42 points. So I would knock this out as best as I can. Try to do as many things as possible. I would write it down. That's how I operate, right? I have a book, I have a pen, and I just do what I gotta do, man. I know a lot of people use Excel sheets. Do whatever is best for you. Me, when I write, it like registers in my brain a little bit better i like visualizing it in front of me i like being able to cross it out it just makes me feel like i'm productive stuff like that so it's a bonus 42 points triple threat online and then we got garland who's been having a great great year he needs 18 assists and 27 points in a game 18 and 27 so if you do the math on that you actually can't do that in a 60 point game you're not gonna have enough because you're gonna need 18 assists that's 36 points 36 points and 27 points it just doesn't add up correctly so you're gonna have to play an actual game so you can do that um in one of like the four minute quarters probably if there is or three five whatever but once you finish all of that all of that you will get galaxy opal devin booker so if you guys know we'll first start off talking about my team right we'll talk about my team a little bit my pink diamond devin booker one of my favorite cards on the no auction house he played 239 games he's averaging over 10 a game man is an absolute stud beast stud muffin literally i, I love this card so now we're gonna get an open one honestly if we're being real DeRozan hasn't even played like that i, I honestly haven't been playing that much lately but I'm trying to pick that up. I'm trying to fix that for the most part. Now, those challenge games, if you don't know where they are, you just go to single player challenges. You'll go to skills challenge. So it's the first one with John Moran screaming in your face. And then it's always these hunt for glory ones. So these hunt for glories, they go to 60. They valid. Do the ones if you don't have them. Like I'm going to do this lunar one. I'm going to get a free lunar pack for like the packs that just came out today. Maybe you'll pull something. But these games go up to 60. You do have to run like one card. So here you'll have to run a jazz player. Here you'll have to run something else or whatever. So I would run like a small player and then let my guys do all the work, whoever I need to do, like the 30 points, six assists, whatever it is, right? Stuff like that. And honestly, I, I honestly love, love, love the player of the month stuff. Shout out to 2K for that. They really, really did a, an amazing job with that. The last ones that came out were great. They were all pretty, pretty dope. Like, they were just a vibe. Like, straight up vibe. Like, this card was amazing. There was, like, Giddy was dope. Like, whatever cards they dropped, some of these diamonds are, are valid. Like, legit valid. They were fun to grind. Like, it was just a fun overall grind. And I'm, I'm very excited to see what's up. Jalen was a beast. I can only imagine what Middleton's gonna be. Man, this is so dope. Shout out to 2K for this. Like, really, really, really shout out to 2K. I hope they keep doing this. We, we said this was the greatest thing they added into the game. And I'm really, really glad they're continuing it. I can't wait to start grinding. Let me know who you guys are most excited about. I, I, I'm, I'm ready, I'm ready. I haven't been playing like that. But I'm ready to lock in. I'm ready to do what I got to do. We will do what we got to do. I'm not about to unlock literally two rubies right now. I'm just going to play triple throw online, drop my 42 points, get two rubies. And then I'm going to pick what's easiest for me. Obviously, that could be whatever I want it to be. Maybe I'm going to take Composo, right, just to get the 12. And then I'll probably end up actually taking Trey Lyles. Trey Lyles makes sense. 21 points, triple threat offline, nice and easy. And then maybe I take Onyeke for the blocks. I like doing that in offline. And then there's some easier ones that you could definitely do. Like, I would probably go Malik because 8 threes online ain't the worst thing in the world. Maybe 19 rebounds online, not the worst thing in the world. Like, you guys can see 
and figure out what you guys would rather do. Some of us like doing blocks, some of us would rather do steals, some of us would rather do this, that. But for the most part, easy, easy grinds. I can't wait to see what the consumable option pack is. I will tweet it out once I see it or get it myself for whatever. So make sure you follow me on Twitter at Most Boy. And yeah, there's a link down below if you guys want to save money. Definitely, definitely check that out. I highly, highly recommend. You will get money back. So sign up with that link down below. And I appreciate you guys. It's been your boy Mosey. I know the drill. Balling out.